Point of View, Chapter One: Who's Telling the Story? Put simply, the narrator is the person telling the story. As a writer, it is up to you to decide who this person should be. To help you decide, first ask some questions about your story. Think about the story you want to tell. What do you want to tell your readers? How do you want them to find out? Where do you want them to go? Whose story is it? Is it a tale of one person's experience or of several people's? What is the setting of your story? Does it take place over a single person's lifetime, or does it stretch over decades, perhaps centuries? How broad is the landscape of your story? How large is your cast of characters? Who would be the best person to tell the story? Would it be better told from the perspective of someone involved in the narrative, or from an outsider's point of view? How close do you want readers to get to the characters? Do you want them to feel like they are part of the narrative, inside a character's head, or do you want to keep them at a distance, as though they are watching the story like a play? Do you want them to feel like characters in the story? Do you want their perspective to be limited to the thoughts, feelings, experiences, and opinions of a single character, or do you want to give them insight into several characters, enabling them to see events from a number of perspectives? Do you want to tell the story, or do you want it to be told by your characters? Questions such as these will help you determine the best perspective from which to tell your story. They will help you to decide whether the story is best seen by someone inside the narrative, or by an observer outside of it. They will also help you to explore such areas as how you want to develop the plot, shape your characters, and engage the reader. Hopefully, helping to clarify how you want your tale to work. Points of view. The points of view from which a narrative can be told are divided into three categories: first person, second person, and third person.